start recording this for the link. There you go. So I hope you, can you see my screen by any chance? All right. All right, everyone. So I hope you're all okay during this difficult moment in our lives. So for those who still don't know me, uh, my name uh, is Tiago Fortunato. I'm the sales manager at Reliance Chateau and I'm based here in New York City. And today we will be covering some properties around Paris region. So good options when you have clients traveling to Paris and if they want to explore around a little bit. Okay. Um, so I will start here with a brief um, uh, introduction on the history of the brand. So we are a non-profit association of luxury hotels and fine dining restaurants. Ta-da, nobody knew that, right? <laughs> so we started in 1954 with an idea to showcase boutique hotels that shared at the same values of hospitality and of course, amazing cuisine experience. And back in 54, the first ground route ever created that we call Route de Bonaire, uh, featured eight properties that linked Paris to the Côte d'Azur, and the idea was pretty much make the Parisians drive and stop, and of course, always enjoying a great hospitality and a meal in a way, right? This course was a great success. Luckily, I have my job here today. We have over 500 hotels worldwide, and our mission is pretty much to transmit mm -hmm. the most authentic experience of the local destination to your clients. All right, so a few advantages of booking Varula and Chateau. Um, of course, I'm your main contact for everything regarding our beautiful properties, but we're a global contact. We assist with itineraries from scratch, so we've tailor-made itineraries for you guys. Mm -hmm. And uh, for every reservation made with Reliance Chateau, the commission is guaranteed, all right? So if you made with us, uh, if you had any issue or any delay with your commission, you can always uh, send to me and I will try to figure out a solution as soon as possible um, to resolve this problem, all right? So here's the toll-free number the email for the reservation department in New York covering all properties, the GDS code. But if you don't have access to the GDS right now, there is the website. So relationchateau.com. In the bottom of the relationchateau.com, there is an access for travel agent. So when you click there, um, you have the option of create your own profile with your IATA number. So you have access to all rates and properties of Rolay and Chateau. So if you're a virtuoso agency here today, you should see all virtuoso rates. If you select, all rates should be there. And of course, if you prefer partner with us, uh, partner with us, the complimentary breakfast offer should be listed there as well. All right. So. Highly recommended as soon as you uh, finish the reservation that you can always send to me so I can double check if everything's okay and then just uh, to arrange all VIP treatments for the hoteliers here. So actually this is a little bit outdated. I have to change that in my presentation. We have now I think all 144 routes um, all over the world. Um, and today of course covering um, Normandy and Champagne region. You cannot see here in the presentation, but there's other routes covering um, the Champagne, of course, including Chantilly. Uh, but you can filter by destination and themes here. And when you click on Discover, you will see like all the properties that are participating in this route, where you can find in a way, the partnership that we have with her. So this is just a good tool to give you inspiration. And of course, um, so you can understand where the properties are located. Um, all right, so the app now for Android as well. So this is a really good tool. So you can have a list of all properties separated by destination. And well, as you can see here, we have 150 properties in France. We're covering only near Paris region in Normandy. And as you can see, Paris is a completely different planet. <laughs> they have all the properties over there, but here, um, you can see as the properties are open and closed, everything is pretty much open right now. We're just waiting for the borders to open for us to go there, right? Here is uh, the itinerary that we're gonna be doing today. Unfortunately, uh, Chateau D'Odrio is not gonna be here with us today because um, Carol, the salesperson from the property, is sick. Um, so I will try to schedule another webinar so we can have Odrio on board. Um, and we can have more updates from the region, all right? 
Um, here, the context of the hotelier is here today. My contact, Amy Goya, my other half, she's amazing. Uh, and my the contact for the reservation department in New York. All right, this is pretty much for me. I will start in home floor with Aurelie. Um, Aurelie, whenever you're ready uh, to start your presentation, and at the end, I will try to give you guys a quick overview of Chateau de Adria so you don't lose the opportunity of seeing something on that okay. region. Okay. All right. Well, we when, yeah. Whenever you're ready. <laughs> Here we go. Okay, so nice to meet you. <laughs> Um, thank you for coming to assist this presentation. So we start in Normandy, in Honfleur, at La Ferme saint -Imeon. So just for you to know about uh, the story of the property, uh, the story starts during the 19th century when the property was just an inn hosted by the Mother Toutain. And she welcomed a lot of young artists uh, painters, more precisely, such as Eugène Boudin, Claude Monet, Jean-Baptiste Corot, Kaltz, etc. And all these painters at this time was not famous, so they stayed here. Uh, they they had their room. The, um, uh, they were they were having dinner, lunch, etc. And to pay the um, the mother tout they were they were giving her paintings. They were trading like that to stay here. And it's Eugène Boudin during the 19th century. Eugène Boudin is native, was native from Honfleur. And he said to other artists that he has found the best place ever to paint outside. Because La Ferme saint Simeon was a very good place to paint outside with the garden because it's facing uh, the Seine River estuary. So the light is changing every hour. Well, it was the perfect place to paint. And thanks to all these young artists, La Ferme saint Simeon became um, the school of saint Simeon in Honfleur. Regarding the, the place, so as you can see on the map, Honfleur is located just two hours on the west coast from Paris. Uh, you have to know that Normandy is the third most visited region in France. We are in Honfleur, we have a very good place to discover all the region. We are very close to all the main sites of World War II, from the American cemetery to Itza Beach, Oma Beach, etc. We are, of course, on the Impressionism Road. As you may know, there is the Garden of Giverny, uh, the famous garden of Claude Monet. You also have Etretat, where Van Gogh painted a lot and Rouen, Honfleur, all these very famous places for Impressionists. But we are also in a central location to discover the typical villages of the region. Deauville, uh, that I'm sure you know this, uh, this famous uh, city, and the Mont Saint-Michel Bay, which is very, very famous uh, in the world. <laughs> but what I will... Uh, explain what I, what, I sh what I want to show you today is this beautiful property, which is La Ferme saint Simeon. So the, the picture you have here, the building you can see on this picture, is the main house dated from the 17th century. What about us? We have 34 rooms, uh, including two signature rooms that are the rooms of Claude Monet when he came during the, the 19th century and also the one of Jean-Baptiste Corot, who is another famous uh, painter that came during the 19th century. We have two restaurants, a gastronomic one with uh, Les Impressionistes and the Bistro La Boucan. Uh, the spa is under complete refurbishment, but we have 700 square meters of spa. Uh, and during the, re the, the refurbishment, there is a, cap a treatment room that is uh, remaining so that we can uh, still propose uh, treatment for our guests. We are virtual member and traveler made hotel partner. So this is very important for you because your guests can enjoy amenities, special amenities. But staying at La France saint Simeon is not just to stay, is a complete experience. As I said before, we have two signature rooms. This one, the, the one that you can see on the picture is the 
famous uh, room of Jean-Baptiste Corot. And he was painting in front of this large window. And when the painting was uh, finished, he put it on the wall and he started a new one because this, with, this window is facing the river. And as the light is changing every hour, the painting was different at any time. The other experience, oh no, excuse me. This is another, <laughs> another example of the room that we have. We, are, we have seven room types from standard uh, room to suites. Uh, they are all unique, as you can see on this picture. There is no, there is, well, they are all unique and they are all beautiful. It's a very good mix between uh, authentic, uh, authentic element and contemporary things. The second experience would be to have a lunch or a dinner for your guests in this patch roof building uh, that has been painted by Claude Monet in 1867. You can see uh, the building on the right of the picture with the, the painting that is in the, the bistro. Here you have an idea of the atmosphere of this uh, restaurant. It's all about seafood here. And the other restaurant is the gastronomic one with the view on the Seine River. Uh, we work, of course, with local products and we are really, uh, really engaged in this, uh, in, in this um, process to protect the, the nature, etc., and to work with, the, with local producers. The third experience would be to have an horse carriage ride uh, in, in Fleur. We have this master horseman who uh, he won the, the horse carriage driving championship in 1920. Oh, in 19, oh, in 2019, sorry. <laughs> and we propose romantic ride in the city center of, of Honfleur. Uh, it's 45 minutes, but it also can be a two hour wide ride in the countryside or a full day to discover all the region in horse carriage, passing by distilleries, etc. Another experience, as you are in a very important place for painting, would be to have a painting lesson with Gervaise. Uh, you can see her on the picture. It's the artist. She's native from Honfleur, and she proposes to our guests to revive the emotion of painters. So your guest can be seated on the gar in the garden painting in front of the river uh, in the same environment that the that, uh, artists were, were painting during the 19th century. And the last experience, one of the last experience we can propose at La Ferme Saint-Simeon uh, would be a treatment with the apple, directly with the fruit on your skin, which is something uh, very, very unique that you only have in Normandy and at La Ferme Saint-Simeon. Uh, just for you to know, so as I said before, the aquatic complex uh, is in the refurbishment at La Ferme Saint-Simeon, but Patricia, which, who is a horror spa manager uh, and winner of the French Massage Championship last year, uh, is here to propose care and, and treatment to our guests because we, convert a, we have converted a room on the treatment room so that we can still propose all the treatments um, at the spa. Uh, a last things for you to know, it would be to, to know that uh, La Ferme Saint-Simeon is part of Relais Chateau, but we are also part of the Collection Saint-Simeon and you will have on this slide all the, um, all the, the restaurants and the hotel of the group and you have all my information. I'm Aurélie Sucré. And just for you to know that sucre means sweet in English. <laughs> you are definitely sweet, my dear. Oh, thank you. <laughs> thank you so much for the presentation. Um, my pleasure. Very, very uh, great update. Uh, let me check here if we have any questions. Uh, for the new folks here present, I did not mention, but you guys will be muted. I see here Scott raised your, um, your hand. So the, the way that you'll be communicating with us will be via chat or the Q&A here. So if you have any questions, please um, send over and I will I'll read all of them loud so we can um, have them to the old room. 
right? So I see here uh, from Whitney, uh, are you open all year round? Yes, yes, we do. All the properties are open all year round. Okay, let me see if I have any other questions. I mean, just to have time for them to type if they have anything, but I mean, what can you uh, share with us in terms of protocols, COVID situation, what happened like in the last few months um, in terms of sanitation or anything that you had from the clients? Um, we, of course, uh, we, we have a lot of, uh, we, we do a lot of things today to, to protect uh, the team and the guests. We have a cleaning process that is uh, very, very, very important, very precisely defined. Um, we have a uh, physical distanciation at the restaurant. Um, we, we work with a, a tablet to our guests that we, we gave them a tablet at the time of checking and they have all the information uh, on this support so that they don't have to, to take a take a, a paper. Mm -hmm. yes. <laughs> um, we have an hygiene manager at the mm -hmm. property. Uh, what's more? I mean, it's okay. Just to, like, to give an idea of just like how was the season. Yeah. I have here another question from Alan. Uh, so uh, what's the price for the two-hour carriage ride? Actually, I do remember that when I was there. <laughs> you did it. It was lovely. I was with my yeah. colleague like going through all the town. It was really nice. So what's the price for, uh, for the activity? Uh, so a two-hour ride is 180 Okay, 280. You said 280, right? What, 100, 100. 180. Okay, got yeah. it. And how far uh, to uh, harbor uh, of home floor? How far is the what? property from the harbor? Oh, it's just five minutes walking. We're, we're between five and ten minutes walking from the, from the harbor and the city center. It's very close. You, you just have to park at the hotel and then you can do everything by foot. Okay. All right. So I uh, see. I see here from uh, Alicia. So can you request, like, specifically for the car road or the money accommodation? Would you um, confirm that in advance? Uh, yes, it's possible. You have to ask it precisely during the the reservation when you when you call when you send the email, and if the the room is available, we can book it by the way. All right. Here, Arlene, I know you want like the image of all properties that I did on my uh, presentation. I will be uh, sharing the link later today on a follow up. So we will have a link of the presentation with all the information um, for you to check when you have time. All right. So I see here. So one more question here from Joyce. Uh, she's just saying she will be on floor this summer. Would you like to do a site inspection? We can definitely not arrange this later, Joyce, but definitely our release the best contact for you. Um, yeah. All right. <laughs> Thank you so much, Aureli, for uh, the presentation. Thank you, um, let's Thank you just... for your time. All right. So let's just move on here. So I have here Nicole ready. Are you there, Nicole, for your presentation? <laughs> Nicole is actually on her holiday, so I'm really sorry. appreciate that she's here for this presentation. Uh, yeah, <laughs> so, sorry. Uh, yeah, bonjour. Can you hear me, everyone? Yeah, I hope yes, so. Yes, I do. So, yes. yeah, <laughs> I, actually, I'm on holidays. I'm going to, just to let you know afterwards, at the end of my presentation, where I am, of course, in Orelay and Chateau Maison as well. But first of all, I will take you to Chantilly. So actually, as you may know, I hope so. So Chantilly is located, uh, let me see how I, uh, can you see when I share? Okay, so Chantilly actually is located just um, 25 minutes from the airport Charles de Gaulle. So north of Paris, one hour driving distance, and we have a direct train from Paris city center actually to Chantilly and only takes you 25 minutes. So Chantilly is actually a great destination for the American market for clients on their last night or even on their first night while they are staying in France. And very often we have clients actually, they combine Chantilly with Normandy. So the, 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 the two properties uh, in Normandy and also with the Champagne area. So it's only like really in the middle. So it takes you to Normandy two hours and the Champagne area to France actually one and a half hour by car. So this is Chantilly, so this is, it's all about actually the destination. 
So the famous chateau, the Chanty, which is the palace actually, known from the James Bond movie, A View to a Kill, uh, is really walking st distance to the hotel. And the hotel is the, the building where you see, see the purple arrow, right in the middle actually, of the historic uh, sites of Chanty. Opposite the hotel, we still have a living horse museum, the Great Stables, and Chanty is known as well for the horses. Therefore, you see just uh, near to the horse museum, the racetrack, and then the little town of Chanty walking distance, little boutiques, restaurants. So actually when clients stay with us, because we are right in the heart of everything, a client does not need actually a car. So the hotel actually so opened now eight years ago. So it was September 2012 when we opened. And right since the beginning, actually, we have been a member of the Railing, Railing Show uh, Association. So in total, actually, the hotel is a new build. Uh, three three uh, floors in total. It looks like a, really like a residential house. And when you walk into the hotel, it's really inspired by the destination, by the chateau itself, 18th century with beautiful interior courtyard. And then all our rooms are actually, they are traditional French with the 12 degree. So there are two different colorings, 67 um, rooms in total. Some of them are connecting, so suitable for families as well. And then within the property, 25 feet as well. And some of the feet, as you can see, on the picture on the left, actually, they have a private terrace overlooking the gardens of the, of the chateau and uh, our um, presidential suite, which is uh, very, uh, you know, a lot of clients like it when they travel with the family, with the nanny, because we can make it up to a 200 square meter suite. Uh, so it's more like, a, like an apartment. And then in terms of gastronomy, so our mission is chef. Anthony he joined us actually in January. So just before we closed the hotel for four months, so uh, due to the COVID uh, situation. And Anthony before actually, he worked more than 10 years actually together with uh, Alain Ducasse in Paris at the Maurice. Also he managed several restaurants for the chef. So we are very happy. He's overseeing all the uh, gastronomy at our hotel, the bistro as well, which is available for more careful dining. When clients stay at our property and also where we serve in the morning for breakfast. In terms of well-being, so we work together with uh, Balmont, five sitting rooms, indoor pool, uh, fitness, sauna, uh, jacuzzi as well. And also we have a nice jogging trails around the area. So there are three different trails to discover the area while, you know, um, doing something important for your health. And then actually our concierge, so Dimitri, he's our head concierge. So he has he really played a very important role while staying at our hotel because he's in charge of all the different experience, activities clients can do. So just to remind you actually, so Shanti, it's a must. So this is the palace as you have already seen before. And inside the palace, actually, we have the second largest art collection of paintings after the Louvre. So for example, the three graces from Raphael are there. There are Delacroix, there's even uh, Leonardo da Vinci at, um, at the chateau. And inside the chateau, really, it looks like a mini Versailles. And as I mentioned before, in the horse museum, we still have like, living, horses, living horses there. We do have a casting shows there as well, um, which takes place like twice a week. And uh, clients can go into the gardens of the chateau and do some yoga sessions there. Uh, private picnics can be organized or like an operativ uh, by our chef. And sometimes even from the US, we have golf uh, players. They are coming to our area. We, of course, there are five golf courses. And there's the most exclusive one actually in France. This is called Mort Fontaine. And our concierge can have private access to this golf course. And then, of course, Chantilly is known for the famous chicken cream uh, and also the first pen. And then, as you can imagine, as you can imagine, actually, Chantilly is as well a destination uh, for weddings, incentive, of course, right at the moment, uh, not really, because we are limited to the number of persons. And uh, our chef as well can cater to all different outlets within the, the chateau, uh, in the gardens, actually, to the dinners and also the cocktail parties.
So actually, I have just the results. And uh, we have a package which is called the Last Friday Card. If you're not familiar um, with it, so it includes one way to get to the airport as well. So we are a member of uh, Virtuoso, Signature, and also Travel Leader. So, and it's a, it's a great way actually to end your stay or to begin the st your stay when you're traveling in car. So, yeah. Merci, Nicole. Thank you so much uh, for the presentation. I do have here a few people already saying how beautiful it is. Um, Magnifique. So actually, Kathy Moha asked you something on the chat that um, is in France, but I believe uh, she's asking for the photos of the property. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Unfortunately, okay. my French is like really limited. Um, so I hear, uh, so she wants, yeah, because I think she wants to do a promotion on social media. So I'll definitely uh, put you in okay. touch. Okay, can, can you me. send me just the email or whatever? If you need uh, some yeah. you know, pictures, then I will send it. Let me just absolutely, it. absolutely. So Kathy, like, right? Okay. Yeah, Kathy Moha. So okay. uh, I have here from Noli. Um, so what is the fee to the airport last day? Um, to, I believe this is for transportation. Uh, is yeah, to the airport, actually, there's a private transfer or a taxi. So it's around uh, 80 euros to go to the airport uh, by tri private transfer. And then by train from Paris, actually, um, this is the easiest way from Paris. Yes, it's a train. It's only, it only takes like 25 minutes. It's a TER train. And it leaves at uh, Gardinor, just right on the same level as the Eurostar from London and the Thomas from uh, Brussels. Around. All right. So here from MT Herring, I think it is also answer your question. He was just asking how far is from Charles de Gaulle. 20, 25 minutes by car from Charles de Gaulle and 25 minutes by train from, uh, from Paris. Yes. All right. So here from Narcisse, um, is the last night in Paris promotion combinable with virtual yes. amenities? Yes. Yes. Actually, what we do always at the hotel, uh, you know, we, we try always to apply to all our different, uh, you know, rates, even promotions, the virtual amenities. Yes. All right. Like 90% like of cases, you know, we, we also upgrade all the clients. Yes. All right. Have you from Leslie? So, what's the exactly the name of the exclusive golf course that you it's have? Mo it's Mort Fontaine. Wait, let mm -hmm. me write this in the chat. Here. Yeah, so she will write in the chat here Fontaine. for you, Leslie. Fontaine. All right. Private golf course. Yes. All right. Wonderful. Let me see if I have any other questions here. Um, I don't think so. I think Rachel Brooks uh, here in the chat also would like to have a brochure of the hotel. Yes. That's and fine. yeah, I think it's pretty much this. Thank you so much, Nicole. I yeah, know can, I just, can I just, my friend, can, can she just say hello? So I'm actually on holidays. I'm mm -hmm. uh, in the south of France. I'm in uh, Provence. So I just uh, <laughs> wait. Hello, everyone. Wait. I have my Hino Eli here. It's a VIP. <laughs> this is going to Can you hear the cicadas? Presence. So I really no, love that you're no, here. It's autumn now. How is everything in south of France, my dear? <laughs> How's everything in South of France? I think now you can hear me. Can you hear me? I lost you. Hold on one second. Sorry. Sorry, <laughs> yes. How is everything in South of France? I'm, I'm it's, thinking, like, everything is phone. fine, thank you. We are mm -hmm. we are good. Bomania are still open, women are still with some guests. So we are we are really happy regarding all the situation, but Bomania is still there and uh, we are not uh, we will not close or anything so we'll be there till the end. That's that's wonderful. So for those here who don't know Manahino Eli, she's the owner of our iconic hotel Beaumonier, Le Beau de Provence in the south of France. So thank you so much for staying here with us. This is bye great. Bye. <laughs> thank you. Thank you to everyone. Thanks. Bye -bye. All right. So, Ivina, uh, I see here from another agent, uh, she cannot see the name of the golf course. So, it's in the chat. So, in your screen there, you see the Q&A and the chat. So, um, Nicole um, wrote here on the chat instead of the Q&A. All right. So, I hear here um, from Christina. So, yes, she's in Bombonier. So, she's just saying that you're jealous. You just made, like, the entire chat so jealous, Nicole. So, thank you so much. <laughs> 
All right. So thank you. So let's move on uh, with Emily right now. Hi, Emily. Are you Hi, ready? Everyone. Hello. Whenever you're ready to uh, yeah. provide information of the melee career. Uh, yeah. Could you see? Yeah, that's fine. You can see the screen. Uh, yes. Whenever. Yes. Okay. Perfect. Okay, so welcome everyone in Champagne. Um, I'm, thank you for your time today. I'm really happy to be here today. Uh, so I'm working for Les Crières. I don't know if you know this property. We are located in Champagne, really close from Paris in Reims. And I'm trying to do, yeah, yes. Uh, so the, the property is located in Reims. Just to remind you where we are exactly, Reims is located only 45 minutes by train from Paris Center, 40 minutes by train from Charles de Gaulle Airport, if you're driving, it's between one hour 15 minutes and one hour 45 minutes. This is our property. It's a 19th century castle. We do have a private garden around the property of seven hectares. So we are in the main center of France, 10 minutes driving from train station, 10 minutes driving from the city center, but located in a, in a very uh, nice garden and also walking distance from the Champagne houses. That means when you start the property, you can uh, go by walk to visit the Champagne cellar like Pommery, Veuve Clicquot, Tétanger, Ruina, between two to five minutes by walk. Um, so the property uh, do have 20 rooms um, from 30 to 40, 75 square meters, sorry, uh, with connecting rooms as well, as well. We have 17 rooms in the main castle at the first and the second floor. And we also have a small cottage like 50 meters from the castle with three rooms. So you can also rent uh, the three rooms as a private villa. Some of the rooms, as you can see on the screen, do have a, a private terrace. So we do organize for honeymoon, anniversary, you know, something unique, a candle dinner on the terrace overlooking the garden. And the property have a, a two Michelin star restaurant, as you can see here. Um, we have a capacity of around 50 people. We can have um, organized privatization like wedding at the property and go up to 90 people in that case. We also have a um, private room for 12 people in the restaurant. So here you will see the chef Philippe Mill. Philippe Mill has been named as one of the best chefs in France in 2011. I don't know if you know this prize is Meilleur Ouvrier de France. And we try to work with only the producer from the region, except for seafood, of course. And we are working actually with 40 producers from the region. This is the bar here, open all the day. Uh, we do organize um, snacks, breakfast, tea time, and of course, champagne tasting. Here in the property, you will be able to test more than 900 different champagne. So this is quite unique in the world. Um, champagne tasting here. The second restaurant we have located in the garden is a brasserie. We have a capacity here of up to 130 people and we have a lovely terrace overlooking the garden. So this is more um, a casual restaurant uh, and we have in this restaurant a bib gourmand. Of course we do have meeting rooms at the property and here at the hotel, of course, you have the champagne tasting close from the property, but also many activities in the town, like the Christmas market. I hope we will be able to organize it uh, this year. And of course, uh, golf, uh, bikes, champagne tasting, picnic in the, in the countryside. So it's a, a unique property uh, close from Paris, as we are only 45 minutes by train from Paris. Um, unique in the world because we are in Champagne. And uh, for Champagne Lover, this is a, a special experience. I don't know if you have any question. Oh, I, I'm sorry. That was actually really <laughs> fast. You're great. <laughs> Thank you so much, Emily. Uh, yes, Domaine Le is one of the hotels that I used to sell every single day. So I do miss like having contacts with you guys. Uh, so let me check here. Um, um, if there's any questions on the chat or in a Q&A. So here uh, from Melissa, do, do you offer any transfers from the train, uh, from the train station? Sure. Yes, we do. Um, we are 10 minutes from the train station, so we do organize when we, we know in advance, of course, 
the, the, we have a driver at the property, so we send our driver, of course. We just need to know like the day before, at least. Okay, so do you charge any fee for that or no? No, usually we do not charge for the guests at the hotel. Okay, wonderful. Let me see if I have any other questions. So can you walk to the Velf Glico uh, or the Pomery Winery? Yes, well, actually, we are just across the street from Pomery and Velf Glico. So it's like two minutes walking from the hotel. Okay, so I have here from David. So I think she would, he would like to have your email. So if you can just like leave sure. here in the chat. I will also send you David in a follow up um, on the presentation. All right. So here from Ellen, do you organize wine tours and how what's going to give us an average of pricing? Sure, we have uh, the concierge at the hotel, so we can organize a uh, champagne tasting. Um, the price is depending of the, of the tasting that you have, but it's between 20 to 45, 30 euro per person. Okay. We do have a special rate actually for the champagne houses. So. All right, so Whitney is just saying so beautiful. Um, let me see if uh, you have any other questions here in the Q&A. So do you, uh, do you have a parking uh, fee or it's a free? It's okay. free. We have a private uh, parking and it's free for the guests. Okay, so which of your categories have terrace? Uh, prestige terrace. We do have two rooms with a terrace and it's called prestige terrace. Okay, and do you guarantee the time of booking? If they... Oh yes, of course. Well, actually the 20 rooms are completely different. So sometimes the guests can see the room on the, on the website and if it's available at the booking, we can guarantee the room. Okay, so and how do uh, how to request different room styles like darker versus like lighter colors? So what are the most popular? How different uh, are they? Well, it's depending on the nationality. Um, mm -hmm. It's completely depending. The P English people do like the, the red, uh, the blue one. So it's depending on the nationality. Yes. And, and are they different in terms of layout or no? No. Okay, they're the same. All right, I think it's pretty much a cover here. Thank all you. of questions, Emily. Thank you so much for your presentation. You. I, yep. you, you're, you're also open, right, uh, for the season? Well, we are open, yes, and we just closed three weeks for Christmas. So this year we are going to close on the 20th of December until the 12th of January. We, oh. every, every year we close for Christmas. All right, all right, so thank you so much for your presentation. Merci thank you. Um, so, I uh, have here people just saying like gorgeous, champagne wishes, great Christina. So let's just move on. Uh, let's just have here, I uh, will have Kingsley on Hello. the presentation. How are you, Kingsley? Very fine, thank you. Bonjour, everybody. Bonjour. So whenever you're ready to share your screen. Okay, here you are. Could you see the screen now, right now? Uh, not yet. You just maybe, there is a green button here to share. No. And you can maybe try it again. This webinar is great. I do miss friends. <laughs> I think you can see it right now. <laughs> All right, yes, I can see the presentation, perfect. If you want to do like a full screen and we're ready to go. So welcome everybody. We are neighbor to Emily, which you, have, you can see here right now. So we are situated in Epernay. Epernay, which is just uh, 30 kilometers from Reims. Uh, you can see right now how it is on the plan. We are in a small village named Vinay. So we have in total 40 rooms, included four junior suite. You can see right now some photos of the junior suite. This is our gastronomic restaurant. We do have only one restaurant. And uh, the hotel is situated between, uh, I don't know if you can situate it, the hotel itself from uh, Epernay. We are south to Epernay, six kilometers only in the middle of the vineyards.
this like, is the uh, main bar. Do you think you could put like the presentation in full screen and have some of the agents asking because I think it's still small for the photos. Let me check it. Okay. I think you need first to activate the contenu and then put the full screen. No. No, I can't. I can't have more than that. It's okay. It's okay. We're gonna try to move Seems on. Seems to be others. yes. Mm -hmm. So yeah, you can see the bar, main bar. Outside garden as well, and some activities which we can organize. All the main activities is between the vineyards, so from uh, from hotel to some small producers. But uh, in Epernay, we have some of the famous as well: Moët et Chandon, Perrier Jouette, Paul Roger, De Castellan, all these uh, Mercier, Champagne Mercier. Here we are. We have 40, in total, 40 rooms. We have three conference rooms. We do organize a conference as well from the hotel. And we have one gastronomic restaurant. We are open the whole year except for Christmas. So this year will be closed like uh, 20 of December, but we will be back as from the third years for the whole year. We do have a spa as well with two beauticians. So we propose spa treatment to our guests. We have an indoor pool with steam bath, sauna and jacuzzi. This is all for me. Um, if so, you have any question about La Bricasserie. So yeah, that I have here from Happy Duma, so she's just asking you to pronounce the name of the hotel again, loud for the room. So, Hostellerie La Bricasserie. All right, so um, here from um, Irvina. So do you have uh, vino therapy treatments at the spa? Of course, of course, we have some vino treatment uh, with uh, uh, grapes, of course, yes. And what will be an average price for the treatment? It's more or less as from 50 euros you can have it. 30 minute treatment goes to 200 euros upon the different treatment, of course. All right, so let me see if I have any other questions. So what's the location area? Like if we can just talk a little bit more, how far from Paris and what's the location? We are just 150 kilometers from Paris. So one hour 30, one hour 15. And uh, the nearest town is Epernay. Okay, so this will be the nearest train station like Epernay? And the nearest train station is from Epernay as well. We are just three miles away from Epernay. All right. So I know we have like other hotels in the area. So how would you like suggest to pair your property? Like before, or after going to Paris? How, or what can you talk about that? So we are we are the only Relais Chateau in Epernay. No, yes, in the Champagne region. So would you suggest to uh, get your property before or like in the last stop before going to Paris? Yeah, most of the guests generally it's like a stopover coming, people coming from the south going to England or inverse or going to Germany. So it's, they, they always stop here for one night, bought some champagne of course, and, uh, and back after. But people come everywhere from uh, uh, United States, for example. Generally, they come here for more than two days because there is many things to see here, and we are not too far from Reims as well. So generally, they are they try to see the cathedral, they try to see uh, 
uh, all the famous champagne in rents as well. Okay, and what's the average uh, rate in terms of pricing? So we start from 280 euros for the standard room, mm -hmm. going to 500 for the genius suite. All right, that's and wonderful. We have some uh, packages as well, including dinner, wine tastings, small vineyards, etc. That's wonderful. I think it covered all of the questions here. Thank you so much uh, for the presentation, Kingsley. Um, Thank you. Let me just uh, move on now with Morgan. Morgan, are you ready for um, the presentation? Bonjour, Morgan. I am. Mm -hmm. Good morning, whenever you, all of you. Whenever you're ready to um, bring all the updates on Chateau de Corsairs. Yes. Can you mm -hmm. see my screen? Uh, yes. Perfect. So welcome uh, in Chateau de Courcel. So we are located near of uh, the Champagne Vineyard too, uh, but in the countryside this time. So just to show you exactly, we are located one hour and 15 minutes from Paris uh, by car, and we are located 35 minutes from the city center of Reims. Uh, so as Emily told you, Reims is only um, 30 minutes, 30, 40 minutes from Paris, so it's very easy to come to see us. Uh, we are located in a very small village called Courcel, so we have a very nice park of uh, 23 hectares, so it's a very good place to rest after a busy time in Paris, for example, or in the city centre of Reims. Uh, we are a very French classical castle, uh, which was built in the 17th century, and we are very glad to share with you and with our guests uh, more than 900 references of champagne and wines. We also have a gourmet restaurant uh, at the chateau, uh, so you have a complete experience in our house. So we are open all year round. Uh, in general, uh, our guests stay two nights at the chateau. We have uh, exactly 18 rooms now, but next week we will have two more rooms. I will show you a first picture of our rooms. We just have uh, set up the furniture inside today, so it's very new. You are the first one to see the color of the new room. Uh, I, as I told you, we have a gourmet restaurant with a capacity of 60 guests, and we can organize also some banquet uh, for weddings, for example but we will have something new again next year, so I will explain you after that. And of course, we can privatize the chateau in order to organize some special events. So our rooms are divided uh, in six categories now. We have the tradition room, so all of our rooms are uh, different from each other. You have here the superior room, the prestige room, so we have some directly in the chateau, but also in the former orangerie with a private terrace, which is very nice for summer time. We have, of course, some suite, which can accommodate some families because you have a living room, uh, which is separated area from the bedroom. We have, of course, a royal suite with the color of uh, the French royalty, blue and gold. And here we are with our new suite, uh, which will be open so next week. Uh, it's a very nice room composed of two bedrooms. So it's very good for families or group of friends. It will be a suite uh, of 100 square meters. So it's very big and we will have the AC in this room. It's something very, very special. Um, I can't tell you more now because it's still a surprise but you will have some new pictures on our website, I think in two weeks now. We have a gourmet restaurant. So our chef, uh, Luca Vanier, uh, use local products. Uh, we are very lucky because we are located near of the Champagne area, but also the Picardy, which is very well known for, um, for country and many uh, grocer, many, many producer. So he has a very classical cuisine, but inspired uh, with modernity. Um, he loves to share his passion uh, for cooking lesson. So we, he, he very enjoys that. So we propose many cooking lessons, very private. 
And of course, uh, you can also enjoy the common areas of the chateau. We have very nice libraries uh, with uh, many old books. And we have, as I told you, a park of 23 hectares. We have a very nice canal directly in our domain. We have a heated swimming pool for summer time. It's still open now, but weather is not nice in France now. So maybe we will have to close very soon, but it's open from in general April or May to October. We also have a tennis court uh, in the park and we can organize some jumping testing directly at the chateau. We can also organize some events directly at the chateau. Uh, so private events like corporate events, but also private events like weddings. So here we are with some pictures of weddings at the chateau. And in fact, we always say that uh, by definition, Courcel is a family affair because Mr. Antonio bought the chateau 30 years ago and he transformed it as a, a restaurant and hotel 30 years ago. And it's now run by his daughter. So we really want people to feel like at home uh, in our chateau. It's a family house and it's important for us to organize some event and to have a new family suite uh, because we want to uh, to share the spirit of the house. And next year, uh, two main projects for us. Uh, we will have a second restaurant in the next village of Courcelles, which is called Brenne. So we, have a, we will have a very nice brasserie conducted by our chef. And we will have a very nice orangerie in the middle of our park to organize more and more events. So see you soon in order to show you real picture of all of this and our new Marie-Louise suite. Lovely. Thank you so much for your presentation again. So great that you have so many projects for the following year. So really good and helps with the positivity. So I have here a few questions. Um, so here from uh, Isabel. So what is, what is the price per day to privatize the property? So it depends on the day, uh, but it begins to it begins from uh, sixteen thousand euros per day, and oh. you have all the rooms, all the park, and you can do whenever whatever you want. Okay, does that include like one night for fifty people? Exactly. So oh. you only have to add uh, food and um, food and beverage. In fact. Okay, so I uh, hear from Whitney. Do you have a minimum night for a buyout? No, we don't. All right, this is actually great. Um, so I have here, let me check here for another questions. I mean, I know, I mean, just the same questions that I did uh, for RLE. I know you're open uh, for, the, for the season. So what can you share in terms of curiosity, uh, challenges and everything for the season that you faced in the hotel? Sorry? What can you share in terms of your, um, I mean, experience um, in terms of sanitation? What did you do? What did you guys are doing um, for the last season, for the summer season? So for summer, summer season, in general, our guests stay at the chateau because they enjoy the park. Um, they, we have some bikes, so they can have a ride uh, in the domain. We have a forest at the chateau, so they can have a ride uh, in our forest. We can organize some massage in the room, so uh, people love to do that. And of course, uh, many of our guests uh, want to visit some jumping houses, so our concierge team can organize that for uh, our guests. All right, everything that was working well during COVID uh, for the past few months or no? Except the cooking lesson, mm -hmm. uh, but we begin from now. We, we do that again. We begin again because it's only private lesson. So with some, um, some new measure, of course, uh, we can do that again now. All right. This is perfect. So thank you so much for the presentation. I'm just checking here if I have any other question. I don't think I have. So we are coming to the end of this lovely webinar, guys. So thank you so much for staying with us until now. So I have here another question here from Kathy. So 
I would definitely, uh, she's just asking to get her in terms of promotion and all her properties. Yes, Kathy, so this is a really good question because everything should be available in the website for you, but you can always uh, email me if you need any, um, any information about the destination or the region so I can just check with the hoteliers and send you all the information about that. All right. So thank you, Eileen here. Thank to you, Chego. Thank you so much. So thank you so much for bringing all the updates from your region. The only thing that we're needing right now is just the borders to be open and of course for everything to go back to their normal. So we do love friends and we hope to be selling more. And and we more will be happy to welcome everybody for the following year. Thank you so much, Kingsley. Um, stay safe, guys, whatever you are. Wash your hands, I always say that. So wear your masks, let's just stay positive and everything should be all right. All right, so thank you. And I will be uh, covering um, in a webinar for the follow, not the following week, but in two weeks for beach destinations. Um, the following week, I will be uh, doing a, some special uh, sales week for some agencies. Uh, so everything that should be handled in terms of webinars should be done with Amy Goya. So she's definitely better than me. She's much sweeter than I. So you guys are in great hands. All right. So thank you. And stay safe wherever you are. All right. Bye-bye, guys. Thank you. Thank you, Isabel.